Hey, I hope everybody's doing well today. I'm just here to deliver a message from God. Today we're going to talk about the prodigal son and the parable of the lost sheep. Now, the parable of the prodigal son starts out with the son asking his father for his inheritance. Then he leaves and, you know, he goes and he's sinful and squanders all the money not knowing that there's a famine coming. When the famine hits, he takes the lowest job he can get, and then he remembers back about his father and how much he misses him and how much he wants him to be welcomed back into his father's arms. As the story goes, he starts walking home, and as soon as the father sees him on the horizon, he comes running to him, arms stretched, just happy to see him. And that's exactly how God comes to us once we've been away from him. We have all fallen away from God in one point in time or another, either through our sinful nature or just out of pure forgetfulness that we are sinful natured beasts. But it doesn't matter how long or how far we've gone from God, the moment we turn back to Him, He's already there, already standing there, arms stretched, running at us full speed. God will never leave us. He's never going to turn His back on us. God is always there. And on those days where we feel like he's not there, that's because we've put sin and guilt and other sinful natured emotions in between our connection. God will come after us. Just like the parable of the sheep farmer, where he has a hundred sheep and one of them runs away, he goes after the one. Not because the one sheep is more important than the rest of the flock, but because he loves that one sheep just as much as he loves the rest of them. That sheep is no more important, but that doesn't mean that the sheep farmer is going to be any less happy to find him, just like God's not going to be any less happy once he finally receives us back into his arms. Don't forget, you are always special in God's eyes, and he's always going to come back after you. These two parables are just trying to show us how much God truly loves us and how no matter what we do against Him, no matter how much we sin, as soon as we ask Him for forgiveness, He'll take us back into His arms. That isn't justification to go out and be as sinful as you want to be because you can get away with it. All I have to do is ask for forgiveness. It's once we get reacquainted with God that we see the work that needs to be done in order to keep that relationship. And I know that's one relationship that I'm definitely going to keep up with. Don't forget, God loves you, and I love you. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share.